Hey there everybody, Rubius here and welcome back to Warhammer 40k Last Crusade. Just a little bit of an update on my impression of this game. As you see, I have been playing this for quite a lot of time. Two weeks ac Yeah, two weeks actually. So, put my impression of the game. It is not like Craft Warriors. But to compare this, it's a earlier type of game. The game that I could compare this one is a browser game that is called Realm of Empires that is more competitive actually. This game is a bit, a bit more lax actually. If I were to say it, um, more on passive, passive on other against other players. Well, I can say that because I'm already in a guild and chances are low that you get, that you will be attacked by other players. Well, guild wars may happen but maybe later in the game when a lot more players are higher level. Right now, it's just improving our bases, increasing our troops and also getting a bit more items for a bit more boosts you may think that this is a pay to win but it is not even non paying players can have a role in this one of them will be can be scouts just a bit of my impression of this this game is a bit more friendly if I were to say it compared to realm of empires well that's it though next time i'll be playing a new game this might be a very short one so i'll try to add a different game hey there everyone and welcome to war of kings as you can see i'm level 2 and i oh well <laughs> Looks like they added gems now. I haven't played this for a long for a while. I haven't played played this for a while and looks like they have a bit of an update. Lot of civilization now. Uh, let's go with let's go with Japan. Let's let's see. With the player and offline. Let's go with offline. I haven't played this for a while. Hopefully that I can still play this. Okay then, let's start the game. Offline. Now this is an RTS game where you collect wood and build stuff. Your goal here is to build a base, build units and then destroy your enemy base. There might be other game modes afterwards as what I, what happened earlier I was surprised with different civilizations they've added them hopefully that I can test them later on I'm gonna play it okay let's go with wheat farm next the building is at the center of the screen rather than you pointing and where to build them so I think it's better for this type of game on a mobile device. It's a bit easier. Ooh, there's heroes now. Let's try this. Call hero. As you can see the resources on the top left corner. There's wood, wheat, iron, then there's gold. Then there's the units. Ooh, hero. Land type hero. Uh -huh. Wow. Let's go with Parax. Let's build Parax. Let, let's build Archer Tower. Next. Wait, wait, wait. There's no wall? There's no wall! <laughs> okay. I think the wall is for multiplayer or maybe dependent on the type of map that you have 
And also, the wall is instantaneous. At least when I played it before, anyway. Looks like I'm losing, guys. <laughs> oh man. Okay, battle started. Okay, the heck? Okay, dead units are sliding. <laughs> the loading time when. For their animation of walking, it's kind of funny. It's like they're sliding on ice. Wait, that may be it. <laughs> the heck? Okay, attack. Okay. Let's finish the game. Yeah, this is just an AI. Just to show you on what is happening here. Okay, I'm burning. Wait, I'm not burning. They're burning. Okay, the explosion still there. Okay, let's go. Okay. Okay. You understand? Now that that's done, and we're back at the lobby. Looks like the gem. Wait, where's the store? Oh, you see, looks like there's only two heroes available. Oh, looks like there are only heroes available. Units are still locked. Huh? That's the usage of gems. Well, that's it for the video. Hope you enjoyed, and hope to see you on the next one. 
बाय